Hello there, this is Stan and I'm going to give you a very quick tour of uh, Seismic Look. Um, basically it's a great silver light interface for um, Twitter. Twitter isn't a very complex service and um, there's only a limited number of things you can do so it should be fairly quick to rattle through this. Um, as you can see here what the uh, Seismic Look interface is doing is uh, presenting um, information from the general Twitter sphere so to speak, uh, just about the most popular threads that are happening at the moment. Um, what I can do is I can pick on any one of these things uh, and it will just basically tell me about all the tweets that people are uh, posting up with regards to, in this case, Memorial Day 2010. Um, obviously, it's a big topic with our American cousins at the moment. Um, if I go back uh, and show you um, what it's about, uh, looking at, say, the inbox, these are tweets that have been specifically um, directed at myself. Um, I can view any sort of the public replies. I can drill down to direct messages or any items that I've sent to other people. Um, but really where the main action is is in the social section. The social section is basically your own Twitter feed. Um, so here, these are the information. Um, these are the sort of tweets that I subscribe to, essentially. So as you can see, it's a fairly slick silver light interface um, looks fairly good uh, it's quite interactive and um, what I can do is I can pick a particular tweet out say this one's uh, the subject of my focus at the moment I can click on a bit of information here and what this will do is it will pull up the profile of the person um, who's who's done this so in this case it's Spindex um, and what I can do is, like any other Twitter client, I can, uh, as well as pulling up the profile, I can uh, post a public reply, I can send a direct message, I can retweet, I can uh, see all the tweets from this particular um, person who's tweeted the message. So in this case, I'm loading up Kin. Um, Kin are fairly prolific at tweeting. Kin is uh, Microsoft's um, new phone, um, just prior to the launch of Windows Phone 7. And as you notice, it also goes into Twitter to have a look at the background information, pulls it out, presents it to you and sees make look so it's quite slick in how it um, integrates with uh, the Twitter service on the web so it's quite nice in doing that if I go back again and take you through um, I don't have any favorites unfortunately but you can mark tweets as favorites um, some of the interests that these are basically tweets are of common interest so in this case the default is news and what it's going to show me is just tweets from various news organizations that's come through an interesting concept is channels and these are really the um i guess the the popular tweets from people red bull is a particularly interesting one obviously they paid some amount of money or uh, they've got a fairly big presence to get their own sort of channel so to speak in here and um, what i can do is see the um tweets that uh relate to red bull and um, drill down to say the athletes uh, pick a particular athlete within red bull and what it'll do is it'll actually show me the athlete the profile again you'll notice the backgrounds change and also um, show me what they've been tweeting for any particular athlete so maybe it's interesting maybe it's not don't know so if I go back here, I guess the, the last thing is, is this is the search, and the search is quite powerful. Again, it's like Twitter, but it's uh, the Twitter web interface, but it's presented in a more powerful fashion. Um, so you, here you can see I've got a search on WPC 2010. Um, I can do another search on, say, uh, the Kin phone again, and uh, what you do is it'll search Twitter for me and bring up any tweets that have uh, popped up re regards to Kin. So that's pretty much uh, Seismic Look. Um, hope that's useful. Cool.